So iOS 16.5 was just released last week and we got a few new features, most of them being on the news app and a new wallpaper. Even though we don't have a lot of new features, we have a lot of complaints when it comes to battery. Everywhere you can see like different posts of different comments from users regarding iOS 16.5 and the battery draining issue. Well, iOS 16.5 will drain the battery of your iPhone but not really. So let me explain what I'm saying here. So this is an issue with an update. So it's not an issue of this particular iOS version, but it's the issue with the update. Every time you update your operating system, basically the operating system iOS in this case, after the update will perform background operations like optimizing the data on your iPhone, maybe rescanning photos and doing all kinds of things that will have an impact and will consume battery in the background. That will happen the first few days and this has been confirmed also by Apple and I will show you guys that and I will show you how it actually works and how you can notice that even on your device. So of course the battery, the battery management will be handled by like different algorithms that will of course also need a few charging cycles in order to adopt with the new iOS update. That's why you're seeing battery drains the first days after you have updated your device. So if we take a look at this response by Apple right here, Apple says that it is normal for your apps and features to need to adjust up to 48 hours after an update. So the iPhone's features and apps and all the data, everything in the background will consume battery. That's why in the first few days you will have a way worse battery life on your iPhone. And we can notice right here. So Right now, my device here is on iOS 16.6 beta. It's not on iOS 16.5, but you can notice this battery life right here. And then once I have updated to this new update, you can see how it drops right here. So you can see at about 100% battery there. So we're getting six and a half hours and then right here, seven hours. And then it goes up to nine hour and nine hours and 22 minutes. And currently with 50% battery, we have four hours and 14 minutes. So you can see it will actually start going up a few days after the update. So that's really, really normal. So if you haven't updated yet to iOS 16.5, because you think it will drain the battery of your iPhone, make sure you update. This is a really important update. You will need this if you want to update to iOS 17, because you won't be able to do it from iOS 16.4. And also it has a lot of different bug fixes and security improvements. So you need this update. Also, if you want to get a bit of battery, battery life on your iPhone, make sure you check out this video that I will leave up there. It will have a few awesome tips and tricks that will help you get better battery life on your iPhone. So that's pretty much for this video, guys. Don't worry about it. I was 16.5, one drain the battery iOS in general does once you update the first few days and then it should go back to normal. So that's it. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video, subscribe for more. I'll see you on the next one.